My name is Krubo Bukali. I'm a lawyer by profession, a university lecturer also. I have been in the FANCA for the rights of women and children. Presently, I work at the Ministry of Foreign Affairs as Deputy Minister for Legal Affairs, Legal Counselor at the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. I have, prior to coming to the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, I worked with NGOs providing legal assistance. I worked with university young women uh, helping to find scholarships because I'm aware that for anybody to be successful, for anybody to realize his or her potentials, that person must have some form of education. And this has been my fight to make sure that people have access to education and not just any kind of education, but quality education that they can be able to make use of life. Education that will take them further. So this has been my passion. And Presently, I'm on the committee for human trafficking because we noticed that during the war in Liberia, many persons lost their daughters because of this. People, girls were adopted and taken to villages where they were used as sex slaves. And we were fighting against that prior to coming to the ministry. I was on the prosecuting team for rape against women, I mean, rape, uh, uh, violence against women, including rape. I was one of the prosecuting attorneys for rape. So I am glad to have come to this uh, summit. It has given me more insight, even though I work with government, which limits my work outside of uh, government, but I can work positively with NGOs where government is not moving. I can work with NGOs to ensure that the rights of women and children are respected and that people have the chance to make use of life the way they want to, in a way that will be positive for the country, not just for themselves, but their life can also be some positive instrument to make our country move forward. That's my, my passion, to see that Liberians, wherever they are from, whatever county, whatever tribe, whatever race, we want to work together to bring our country to what it is supposed to be. And when one person cannot do it, the president cannot do it alone, those in government cannot do it alone, but it has to be a concerted effort of all Liberians and our partners in progress. So we want to thank everybody who has provided the means for this conference. And I can assure you that my conference is not, my door is not just going to be closed here. I'm going to carry this out and work with uh, the Ministry of Gender, the other ministries and other NGOs to help uh, implement what I have learned here today or this uh, week. I want to thank you very much.